So have you ever tried to follow one of those videos where somebody shows you how to find the center of your spawn chunks in Minecraft and you're just left more confused than ever? Well, guess what? I've got something for you. My name is Tumble Dumpling and I build function files. And today I've built a function file that helps you find the center of your spawn chunks. Let's have a look at this. So the first thing you need to do is download the function files. They are on Google Drive. There is a link in the description below. The second thing you need to do is put it in the appropriate save game location. If you don't know where to put your function files, there is another video in the description below. Where do I put my function files? Now, assuming you've done all that. Now, all we're going to do is go anywhere in the overworld. And before we use this, we need to turn down our render settings. So I'm going to press escape and go into my options and video settings and I'm going to take my render distance and I'm going to turn it down to six. I don't want it any more than that. That could really conflict with how this works. All right, now that I got my render distance down, I can run this thing. I'm going to type in slash function and spawn check 115 X. I'm going to hit enter and it runs a whole bunch of commands and the sign pops up right where I'm standing spawn center x coordinate negative 176 z coordinate negative 80 and it also gives us our chunk coordinates now at this point i can turn my render settings back up because i no longer need to have them reduced i'm just going to set it to 16 because i feel like it now i need to press the f3 button which brings up debug screen and what i'm looking for is the section that says x y z and i need to walk over to X coordinate, negative 176, and Z coordinate, negative 80. So I'm going to just leave that open and walk towards it. Now, I can fly, so let's go a little bit faster. And we're getting closer, closer, closer. So 176. And 80. Right there. You know what? I'm going to bring out a special block, one that stands out. Now, let's have a look at where this lines up. So, what I'm going to do is press, press and hold F3 and then press G. And that brings up my actual grid, my chunk grid. You're going to notice that this block right here is on the northwest corner of the grid. Now, this is not the center of your spawn chunks. The whole chunk is the center of your spawn chunks. I've just marked that block because, well, frankly, I'm going to use it in another function file build coming up. So congratulations, you've just found the center of your spawn chunks. Your spawn chunks will extend 11 chunks in every direction from here. And if you want more information on spawn chunks and how they work, I've got a link in the description below for that as well. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you enjoy finding your spawn chunk and doing whatever you please with it. Like, comment, subscribe, and follow me on Twitter. You have yourself a good day. So some of you might be wondering how this thing actually works. Well, it uses a four point triangulation four-point triangulation, that doesn't make any sense. Rectangulation?